But I too want to support this and compliment the Minister in putting forward this fund. At global leaders, that's what we are in horse racing, and we're so proud of it in Tipperary, and what Tipperary leads, Ireland follows. The Greyhound Industry Dinner and Deputy Council has just left, but I take no truck on what somebody on uh, the Greyhound Board said to her. That's horrible. It's not, it's not needed in this time. But we need support. We need regulations. And we need to root out any semblance of, of um, uh, cruelty to animals if it's there. But I would encourage uh, Deputy Kent, if she come in again with a protest, to bring a greyhound, if she's talking about greyhounds, not a lurcher. I want to salute the men and women, and there are many women involved in the greyhound racing and greyhound industry in Tipperary, and families, and it's the vital uh, lifeblood of their community, and the enjoyment they give them to others, and the amount of funds that are raised at nights at the dogs, and race meetings, and everything else. So we're going to cut our nose despite our, 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 our face. And I said this last week, are we going to be utopian? country here, with wasteland, with no industry in rural Ireland, and we'll be all, you know, smoke marijuana or something. Is that what we're aiming for? I mean, it's, it's a silly and childish and pedantic way to look at an industry that's so vital to our economy. We must support it. The Natalie Curlick Hale, Egoni, and support the men and women that are in it. By all means, have proper regulations and reform the Greyhound Board. It's bad in need of reform, Minister. Thank you. Thank you.